Hey guys, I'm Bart and this is Kyle. Welcome to I'll Drink to That. Today we have Fighting Cock. Fighting Cock. Right, that's what we're playing with today. We're playing with the old Fighting Cock. I think that's illegal in some states. I think every state. <laughs> I think it's I illegal think, in every state, but yeah. it's not illegal to drink something named Fighting Cock. So we're definitely going to try Have you had this before? I have not. I have not. Never, ever. Neither no. one of us have ever had this before. i got to say a special shout out to a friend of ours, Chris. Thank you so much. This was donated to the channel. We appreciate it. it yeah, no, Maybe. Maybe. Maybe it's terrible. I don't Maybe. know. We're going to find out. But anyway, I do appreciate the gesture. Hopefully, it's an awesome, awesome fla flavor tasting thing. Let's just get at it, man. What do you know about it? What do you know about okay. it? Okay. So, it was made. Uh, let's see. So, it's it's a straight bourbon. Fighting Cock Distilling Company is the company that makes it. Distillery is Heaven Hill. So, it's, uh, let's see. The mash bill on it is 75% corn, 13% rye. Which is, I mean, you're not going to probably well, might not taste it fan, but let's give it a shot, 12% right? malted barley, and it's less than $20 most places. That's the MSRP. He That's got a price tag. Yeah, price tag. eighteen ninety nine. Eighteen ninety nine on the price tag. For so. 103 proof. So if right. you're looking to... I'm just going to... You go ahead and talk, man. I'm yeah, going to this. Yeah, have at it. So they released it as kind of like a, a direct competitor to Wild Turkey 101, Ooh -hoo -hoo. which is 101 Ooh -hoo -hoo. proof. So they kind of made it two more... Two more proof higher, and yeah, <laughs> two more proof higher, and that makes it. Uh, and, and yeah, from what I from what I've heard, it's it's similar to Wild Turkey One Hundred One. If you've I ever actually had like it, Wild so. Turkey, man. I do have you like had it. the One Hundred One, or have you, you had know, the original? Original, original. original? original? I know One Hundred One. Okay. I can't say I've ever had. So, have you? Yeah, have it's you actually in it? my freezer right now. And I I should have brought it. Oh, I didn't think about it. Yeah, comparison of that there. it to you. We'll, we'll do that next video. Then it kind of. We'll, we'll still have this bottle, I'm sure. Yeah. 103 proof doesn't take uh, too much to feel it, so I imagine <laughs> where it's not going to go through very fast. So let's take a look. So you want to pour it? I do. You want to get right at it? Yeah, let's get right Dude, at I it. I got no problem with that. So the nose is, it says on the website or whatever, it says banana forward with light vanilla, walnut, and oak in the background. I'm a little interested in that banana, it says, it's right? A, yeah. I don't think I've had anything with banana. Or it has said that it has banana. It said it has banana, yeah. It, it says it doesn't, just a little bit. Just a little bit, you got it, man. It's, 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 it's Memorial, right there is good. It's Memorial Week and I don't want to drink and drive. Definitely don't. Don't drink and drive. This is at my house right now. Whatever background you're seeing right now is not real. So, <laughs> but it, this is just at my house. It, it's, so I will drink, What it, I'm not driving. What it's saying is it doesn't have a complex aroma. But its simplicity doesn't mean it's boring either. No, it doesn't have much so, of an aroma. It's not. It's not a punch you in the face flavor for sure or scent. You yeah. know, you're not like going, "Oh man, it smells like a hospital room or antiseptic." You know, alcohol. If you kind of if you kind of put your nose in there and, and then breathe into it and then breathe, it kind of burns your eyeballs a little. Oh, it does. <laughs> house house will cry. You cry. You're gonna make me cry. Yeah. I'm gonna cry and do it again. I gotta do it again. I love I love torture I would, myself. I would say this is the highest proof we've had on the, <laughs> the on the on the channel, right? It is, it is. It's probably cracking the glass. That stuff, I'm telling you what, it smells very, very strong. It's very not strong. like a strong, nasty smell, but you can definitely tell that it's it's, it's, it's a definite straight bourbon whiskey. So. Oh yeah. I'm so excited about this, Kyle. You have no idea, because I love love whiskey right oh yeah I, I, especially punch in the mouth whiskey that's kind of man. Weird. a straight bourbon punch in the mouth whiskey is what i'm all about so i'm super excited about trying this so no banana no banana not getting any banana i'm not getting much of anything so that's that's pretty right on about how about you i'm getting the oak it says there's oak, oak in the background but i'm getting that like walnutty oak right there you can definitely smell like the barrel to it. So, gosh, I want to get into this, man. I don't drink it. Get into it. Okay, we'll taste it first, and then I'll. So okay. we'll do the opposite of nosing. So, you taste it. Tell me what you think, and then I'll tell you what the palate is after. All right, here we go. Mm. Burns your lips. Ooh, it burns your face, it man. Definitely burns your lips. <laughs> oh my gosh! Ugh. Don't do that with chat <laughs> lips, man. Don't no, do that. That's, kinda... that's kind of what I was thinking. If, if you Woo! don't have chap lips, you're going to have chap lips. Whoa, man. I have never put a whiskey in my mouth that burnt like like a hot pepper or something, right? Yeah. That's kind of a... a man, like, that tastes good, though. This is my stuff. This is, this is my kind of thing. I'll say it's 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 spicy, mm -hmm. but it dissipates really fast. Really fast, yeah. Which is kind of nice. It's it's one of those ones that's like, you know you're drinking it. It definitely has... I my think, tongue red. It's a little red. Is my tongue? Dude, it's burning my tongue. A little bit. A little bit? 
It's like cin- cinnamon on your tongue or something. That's weird. That's so odd. That's it's awkward. Got a lot of alcohol. You probably use it as mouthwash. I mean, you would probably use it to start a fire. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> you can do all kinds <laughs> of stuff with this. You can take paint off the wall. Whatever you want to do. Oh my gosh. Mm. So what are you getting? What are you getting from it? What's this? Mm. What are you tasting? Oh, buddy, that is my kind of thing. I love the punch you in the mouth type of. This has that whiskey punch you in the mouth type of thing. I don't. I, I think I get a little bit of the rye taste, but I, I think it's because I know it's there, right? If, yeah. if I didn't know I feel, it's there, I don't I feel think like I if I didn't tell you, yeah, I, I may not know. I have, I have a hard time with that. He tells me what's in it, and it's like that's all I can taste, and is that rye? I so hate rye. I think that's, that's why I'm trying to like. Let's see what what you think the palate is. That okay. way, I didn't like. I'm gonna do. It, I'm just gonna keep doing it each time. I'm gonna look for something new. Something new. Mm. Boy, where is? I'm not gonna lie, man. <laughs> Woo wee! Woo! Dude, burned dude. my face off. All right, so I got the oak. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah, no yeah, doubt. Yeah. There's an oak char taste to it, but it's not strong. I'm not a Scotch guy just because it seems like most of the Scotches have that like that oak. Are you, are you getting sweet oak? Because it's, 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 it's like sweet barrel. It's not like yeah. that like crazy bitter. Okay, like, you know what I'm saying? That crazy bitter barrel you get. Yeah. It's I can't get over my tongue right now. And I'm trying to talk, and I'm just like, it's like boom. numb. Woo. Woo. I need to <laughs> slap my tongue. <laughs> I feel like we're drooling. Don't know. Yeah. It's just, uh, it's just numbing your it's mouth. Kinda, yeah, when you go to the dentist, you know they put yeah. the stuff in. It feels like that to your mouth, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the yeah, taste yeah. is good. It, I, I don't have any issues with taste. I do no. have the oak, a sweet oak, and I think that's what I love so much like, about regular bourbon, is the sweetness, man. Just like a it, vanilla, yeah. like yeah, vanilla yeah. barrel, like yeah. Like your it's like not vanilla, firewood. like vanilla cream soda, like you know how they yes. have that, like yes, that kind of sweetness to it. Where yeah, the, where the other like the Scotch has that literal like fire log. Taste. Yeah, you know it's more of a yeah. a manly burnt. You know, oak. You know yeah. I, I'm not. I'm not man. I don't like manly burnt. I don't know. It's a hundred and three proof. I would I wouldn't man. say it's not manly. That's true. And most of those Scotches, you know, forty percent. You know, this is you know fifty one percent. So I mean, oh buddy, that is so mean all day long. I definitely think this would be, it's good on its own. I would like to taste it with Coke. Yeah, with Coke would be nice. Even ice, yeah. It'd be one of those ones that unless, if you want to sip and like feel it, like just a little bit, but you'd really want to mix it because I I can't see me, it's 103 proof. I feel like if I had, you know, a nice glass full of it. You got a glass full of that, you're going to be. That's about all you're going to be drinking that whole night. So you're going to baby it. You're going to lose one layer of your tongue. One yeah. layer of your tongue will be, be gone. gone. I can feel it eating it right now. Sandpaper right now. Right? So, it's, so yes or no, you like it? Mm-hmm. Dude, I think it's amazing. I really like it. Look how clear that is, too. I mean, it looks good. The bottle's really nice. I kind of, yeah. I think that's one of, what, what Chris was saying when he, when he when he handed it over was, that that's the one thing that stuck out was just the bottle, like, fighting cock, like, come on, we're all, like, 12-year-old kids at heart. Like, how can you not like the name? Like, <laughs> right, right. Fighting I'm trying so hard to be, like, it a little yeah. bit like that, right? Oh, yeah. Dude, I absolutely love it. Chris, awesome idea. We Thank you for sharing that with it. us. Yeah. I, I think on a range of 1 to 10, I'm a bourbon guy. I absolutely love bourbon. I'm putting this up there in 8. Ooh. I'm going to 8, man. I'm going way up there pretty high on that because it makes me happy. That is my kind of drink right there. I love it. I can I love it. I'm going I'm to go with you on 8, too. 8? Definitely price. I because like I said, I do have that wild turkey 101. We'll probably do that next video sure, too. Sure. Kind of maybe do a comparison. We'll still have this kind of bring it back out. I I think this is better than wild turkey 101. Smoother, for in sure. my opinion, I, from what I remember of the wild turkey. I've never had yeah, 101, but it's 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 still punchy in the mouth. But I think it's more that that, that punch you in the tongue. Yeah, punch you in the tongue. So I think this is I think this is a lot better. So I really like it. I think. I think I'd be buying a lot more of it just to oh, have it around because yeah. eighteen dollars, eighteen dollars, twenty dollar whiskey. Oh yeah. What is Old Crow? Good. What is my old standby? Old Crow is twenty bucks, fourteen bucks, yeah, somewhere in there. Along there, but I mean that is a half gallon, right? Oh, that's true. But that's I true. mean, Old Crow still got the price for the. But, but the taste wise, and it gosh. has it has more alcohol content. So I mean, you could probably drink it a does. little less, and it might go a little. It does hundred and it tastes, one. My opinion, it tastes better than Old Crow. I, I did the video, so I, I mean, you, you can see. Yeah, obviously, this got eight. I think Oak Crow got three or four. Yeah, something, something along like that, that line. Yeah. So yeah. definitely, definitely a better whiskey. I would definitely recommend it. You guys give this a shot. If you don't mind that punch you in the in the tongue or or the, in your face, 103 proof alcohol, you're going to get a little bit of that, yeah. which I enjoy. 
if you like that as well, definitely give this a shot, guys. That's that's it's a no brainer for me. That's that's an amazing whiskey. Thank you again, Chris. Very we very appreciate it. Really yeah, appreciate thank you. it. So, with that being said, anything else? That'll be it, I think. Yeah, guys, I, mean, I, think I we went over everything. Yeah, right? yeah, absolutely, guys. I appreciate y'all coming along. I had a great time. This 103 proof is gonna. Memorial Day weekend, like yeah. I said, I'm going to feel it. you got to drive. I don't. Oh, so yeah. No I'm going to be very, very happy. So, as always, guys, we appreciate you coming along. And until next time, I'll drink to that. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Don't drink and drive. Seriously. No, no, no. Drink and sleep, but don't drink and drive. There you go. <laughs>